another star citizen alpha 3.18 patch ptu patch just dropped tonight man it was around 12 just after 12 this uh saturday morning and uh it's actually quite late it's actually surprising that they actually still did it and um so this one is for all backers as usual since now it's in wave three and it's active on all the servers us eu australia and asia and um when it comes to the feature updates it has here this pertains to ships and vehicles they, they adjusted the m50 atmosphere tuning based on racing performance feedback to bring it more in line with other racers okay so they also mentioned some bug fixes down here it says this build has had many extra fixes for the trams in landing zones to help them detect if they are about to collide or outright stop to help them not get stuck if they do happen to get stuck we have to put in an extra logic to detect them being stopped and will force them to reset position to default if it detects trams not moving this is a temporary this is temporary and will be immersion breaking for now if it does happen but this is a temporary workaround in case issues still occur some more bug fixes trams become stuck after reaching their destination that's been fixed when it comes to the top section of the p72 is white as the default non-emerald paint so now that's that's in regards to the archimedes itself and em the emerald archimedes all right so when it comes to walking in shallow waters make the area darking it says the mining ui in turret is small and low resolution and hard to read when it comes to vehicle controls it says vehicles may be unable to lift from the pad after retrieving from the asop terminal that's been fixed when it comes to um, reputation security contract evaluation is not re-offered upon failure i didn't notice that that's been fixed the gems of hadonite appear as aphrodite when hovered over in player inventory that's been fixed when it comes to spk spawn closets have this area where when opening don't know what that means when it comes to vehicle cargo after snapping to the cargo grid rmc commodity crates can, cannot be detected again with the tractor beam interesting so that's been fixed the top airlock of the reclaimer lacks appropriate collision and can allow players to fall through to access the ship it also says some ships that can hold cargo will show cargo capacity of zero that's interesting so that's been fixed this one is also an exploit here it says party members who die in combat can become undetectable to each other and dev tools on foot or vehicles interesting they also mentioned here the designated hangar not displaying on the asop terminal after retrieving a ship that's been fixed all vehicles are blurred on the vma that's been fixed selling some of the cargo while the vehicle is stored caused the cargo to show at max inventory capacity that's been fixed r and r clinic pharmacy kiosk terminals do not have sales inventory displayed that's been fixed fps harvestable rocks become unresponsive after charging and not fracturing that's been fixed derelict wrecks have incorrect highlighted colors when targeted in the salvage mode that's been fixed also when it comes to trams again are out of sync with the station timer causing trams to overlap and not appear on time that's been fixed as well in addition to this they fixed 12 client crashes as well as nine server crashes you guys let me know your thoughts on this down below i'll see you on the next video